enter the Empress. <laughs> Nobody makes an entrance quite like Asuka. The following contest is a fatal five-way match. Making your way to the ring from Osaka, Japan. It always seems the higher the stakes, the more powerful the Empress becomes. Asuka is always on point. She can shut your lights out in the blink of an eye. And you've always got to be wary of the poison mist. If you want to earn respect, if you want to make a name for yourself in the women's division, you got to go through the Empress. A truly destructive force, a buzzsaw in the women's division. If you are lacing them up against Asuka, be prepared for the fight of your life. She is a woman who is here to take control. And representing damage control from San Jose, California, Bailey. Ding dong, hello. She has crashed the party and taken the women's division by force. And Bailey now has more muscle by her side than ever. Bailey claims that the locker room needs to learn that the world does not revolve around them. Because it's the role model's world and we're just living in it. Do we have to? This is a match she has long been asking for. She is more than ready to compete tonight. The man is here. A competitor down from a fight and from Dublin Ireland Becky Lynch a woman who has devoted her career to elevating the women's division yeah. arguably the hardest working competitor in the women's division and she's also a leader and she's a trailblazer Well, you could say that Becky Lynch has carved out a Hall of Fame career simply because she has believed in herself every step of the way. by her success in the ring. And from Staten Island, New York, the most beautiful woman in all of WWE, Carmella! Carmella's proven herself as one of the most talented in-ring competitors, but according to Carmella and Corey, She's also the best looking. According to many people, Cole, you clearly just don't speak to the right people. Well, Byron told me she wasn't best looking. Why are you being a snitch, Michael? Would you take the advice on whiskey from someone who's never had a drink? I don't think so. Gone are the days of moonwalking 
The trash talking remains, and let's be honest, I think we were all a little bit over the dance break thing. Hey, I miss those dance breaks. You're the one. Here comes Alexa Bliss. And Lily, too. Ugh. And from Columbus, Ohio, Alexa Bliss. It seems like Alexa is back from the dark side, but she brought back a friend, Lily. Uh, I wish she hadn't. Oh, don't be jealous, Saxton. We know your favorite doll recently popped. We are seconds away from another moment of bliss. Blissful for us, not for her opponent. The bell is rung and anything goes in this no disqualification match. This is just going to be a brawl that can turn real ugly real quick. No rules to her babies, no limit on how nasty this one can get. And I love it. Kick to the gut. Hammerlock applied. They talk about giving a DDT with authority. Ooh. Oh, jumping arm break. Ooh, elbow strike. Wait a minute, setting in. Devastating submission coming. And Becky Lynch holding on. Oh, this is unique. Oh, man, a counter. Great escape. She turns it right around with a counter. Right forward. Stipulation means you have to throw your regular playbook out the window. This not going to save you here. It's time to get extreme. You make a good point, Corey. Every offense just isn't going to cut it in this kind of match. Oh, boy, she found a kendo stick. This match might just get hard to watch. Kendo stick it back. Ooh, that hurt. That'll ring your bell. moment to summon all of her strength. Good kick! Oh, man, they do not care who or what they destroy. Yeah, Byron, you are dangerously close, but you got the shoulders down. She gets the shoulder up. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. Oh, man, get it up there. Shoulders down. Kicks out after one. She's not done yet, but you have to believe that she's still in all sorts of trouble. Six. 
Oscar with a kick downstairs. Up to that was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Oh, there it is. The Oscar lock. Uh-oh. Or opponent trying breaking it up at the last second. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Picked up. These ladies going toe to toe. Here is your winner, Becky Lynch. Sharon's the W against fierce competition. A win like this always makes me happy. I kind of want to hop in there and celebrate with them. is a tag team match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 492 pounds, Angelo Douglas and Montez Ford, the Street Profits! <laughs> Triple Crown Tag Team Champions, NXT Raw and SmackDown! You know what that means, Michael? It doesn't matter what the brand is, the Street Profits oh, always Bella. bring the smoke. Gentlemen, class is in session. That's right, Cole. Show a little respect for Master Gable and the number one guy, Otis. And their opponents at a combined weight of 532 pounds. Otis and Chad Gable, the Alpha Academy. Two amateur wrestling standouts 
trained together before either man joined WWE. And tonight we get to watch their amazing wrestling skills, to which I say, a thank you. smoke because someone's uh -oh. about to get it from the Street Profits. Montez Ford and Angelo Dawkins, these guys have a resting confidence level on 100, and it's easy to see why. It's been a long time since we've had a team with the pure talent and charisma that these guys do. They say some people were made for this industry, and clearly Ford and Dawkins are in that category. And if I may politely shoosh you, we are in the presence of true excellence with the Alpha Academy. An unlikely duo that has found success under Chad Gable's teachings. Their pearls of wisdom are effective sometimes, but far from perfect. No, on the contrary, Saxton, they are perfect. A 4.0 GPA kind of perfect. I know you're jealous because you never passed finger painting class, but stop eating the glue and try to keep up. Oh, just scrubbing the face on the canvas. And an elbow drop, too. Military press! Now oh, pull the hair. And turn it in. He's got him down. Is this it? A little over eager with that cover. He is certainly sending a message, getting his shoulder up before two. Seated drop kick. Super kick! He must have had that scouted. Tags him in. Uh -oh. Wow, the power that takes is insane. And you he breaks it up. I don't know how much longer his partner could have lasted. Shoulder block off the apron. Look out. Looks like they do not want them inside the ring anymore. Time from the top. Montez Ford so elusive. Textbook scoop slam. standing moonsault like that. It's not over yet. Plenty left to go in this one. He's getting a little better now. He got whipped into that corner. Tag made. What's in store here? Drop toe hold. Toe hold on the elbow on the back of the neck. He wasn't tough enough contending with one opponent. Now you got to deal with two. Look at this, going counter for counter. 
Example of tag team wrestling you're ever likely to see. a man, the man who is one of the most accomplished stars in the history of WWE. Just one of the many reasons why he is the A-lister. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds. The well, the one thing we do know about The Miz is that he is living his childhood dream, being a WWE superstar, and 
he has redefined what it means to be a WWE superstar. Finally, put a little respect on his name, Saxton. Miz is a reality TV icon, a movie star, Grand Slam champion two times over, WrestleMania headliner. Oh, and he's the it couple with Maurice. Oh, this is my favorite part. He's going to sing. Y'all know what time it is. This is the part where we crank it up. Let's crank it up. Now, here we go. People over there, what's up? You feel me? Stand up and say what's up. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? You can get with this or you can get with that. You better get with this because this is where it's at. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? See, I be skipping and jumping, leaving the competition. I make them disappear like your favorite magician. And I ride it till the wheel fall off. I bounce back to back till their necks get soft. Most of the time you see me, I'm being simple. Too many times I'll be busting them up like a pimple. Stating my claim to fame. To be one of the baddest young brothers step foot in this game. And I haven't even started yet. You can better believe I take it off the show I bet. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Love him or hate him, the Miz has earned his place here in WWE. And found plenty of awesome fame and fortune along the way. True, and tonight he's eager to show everyone just how awesome he is inside the ring. And I get Okay, he is not going to let him make a mockery of things. And a drop kick. Picture perfect. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Off the barricade. He reverses it. Oh, with authority! Yeah. Three. Reversal, can they go on the attack? Oh, colliding with a barricade. Oh no, what could this be? Oh, don't do this. Hung up in the barricade! In a big boot! Corey, what's the most important thing to keep in mind when squaring off with our truth That's easy. Never underestimate it. Truth may have a reputation for being an easygoing prankster, but don't let that fool you. What's this, Corey? I think they're looking for the Ramirez special. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ramirez. Will this match end up? Oh, look at that. And somehow he's able to work his way out. to the neck, neck breaker. Hey, uh, now is no time to dance. Are no. you kidding me? <laughs> I love it. Here's the cover. Good officiating there. Referee seeing him the ropes and breaking the count. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. Getting him into the corner. Gomez turns the tables. Ah, there's the backbreaker. Backbreaker. And he wants nothing to do with any of that. Yeah, this tracks. Miz never did meet a crowd he didn't know how to play to. The Miz looking a little bit shaken. Kick to the gut. Right the line into a neck breaker. Uh, Caught him right the jaw. Ugh, what a shot. Set him up for something here. Oof. High risk here. I don't know what more we could see in this match. From the top. High risk. Truth caught by surprise. Star. 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 Star.
looking pretty awesome. Oh, uh, slow down. It's still too Here it comes. For the score crushing finale. Miz can taste it now. Two. The Miz did a huge win there. That match deserves another look, folks. Here is your winner, The Miz! What a win for him here. He really displayed his prowess in victory. This victory is exactly the kind of statement I knew he wanted to make here. This was a message from him to the entire WWE Universe. Star with plenty of accolades. The youngest United States champion and the youngest Money in the Bank winner in WWE history. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the WWE United States champion, Austin the potential in the world, but unfortunately, a bad attitude, too. Cruiserweight title, tag team titles, but tonight Cedric looks for even more success. Cedric Alexander has proven he can compete at any level in any type of match against any superstar, so you better be ready. No one can deny that Cedric Alexander is one heck of an athlete. But lately, it's his intensity, or perhaps over-enthusiasm, that has been the topic of discussion. Since when is intensity or enthusiasm a bad thing? Especially in Cedric's case, as it's only helped him when it comes to the win-loss cover. He wasn't even close on that pin attempt. Showing some extra scouting, knowing how to answer a counter with a counter of your own. down like that, having the wind knocked out of you. Never a good time for that to happen. Picture perfect drop kick. And I have to wonder, Corey, what would Austin Theory's game plan be for this matchup? We know he's got a lot of raw talent, but 
that can't always get the job done. Fair point, Cole, which is why Theory needs to rely on more than just said raw talent. He needs to rely on his in-ring smarts. If he can put together his brains and brawn, Theory might be unstoppable. Boom, what impact! Out, they're going to pay dearly for it. Irish curse backbreaker. Fight is so close to our announce table. Yeah, I'm just going to step aside now. Hey, wait for me. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. he's going look he's just taking the perfect opportunity to regain some composure oh he's got him up high the follow-away slam it couldn't have felt good being chucked around like that Right forearm. Oh, what a clubbing blow. He gets out of the way. Tying up their opponent. Brainbuster to the knee. Theory's size and strength on full display with that one. Here it comes. Oh, Will that clinch it for Theory? Is it enough? The corner. The now look to count. Oh, man, the look on Cedric's face. Maybe even he surprised himself with that one. And Theory clearly thought he had it there. He might have to consider a new strategy at this point. And he's able to counter. Picture perfect drop kick. And Theory this could do it. He kicks out before the count starts. How did he do that? Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's got to hurt. Just cranking the head. Punishing stretch. Picking up the lifeless body of their opponent. Up and down with the gut buster. Cover. Shoulder shoots up before two. No time to waste being shocked. You've got to maintain pressure.
This superstar taking interest in the champ, and the champ is saying, you want some? Come on down. Well, Mustafa Ali promises you will not forget his name. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 182 pounds, Mustafa Ali! A man who has become virtually obsessed with not allowing himself to be mislabeled anymore. Major chip on his shoulder. Priest embodies no mercy, no remorse. He's a sadistic individual. So you need tenacity just to survive the man. Damian Priest has arrived. A man who will bring judgment to all of WWE. And his opponent, accompanied by Rhea Ripley, representing the Judgment Day. From New York, New York, weighing in at 249 pounds, Damian Priest. No longer cares for the WWE Universe, no longer cares for the rest of the locker room because he has found his true family, and the Judgment Day is their name. Multiple title reigns in his career already, but Priest wants even more. And there's nobody who can stand in his way. And Damian Priest kicking things off here. A formidable superstar with new purpose, I think, in the Judgment Day. Priest has completely refocused himself. He used to be about the light and the dark, and now he's all about punishment. Single-minded and ruthless as they come. I think we're about to see a side of him we never even imagined. Bad news for anyone who steps in the ring with him, I fear. And with Mustafa Ali, he's just the kind of guy who's all about determination when the bell rings. You might beat him, but you are not going to do so without putting in... This could do it. Not even close. <laughs> Mustafa Ali is an incredible athlete, but what's that X factor that could help him get the better of his opponent? Well, it's got to be his willingness to do whatever it takes. Mustafa Ali is done playing fair, and he's become more cunning than ever. That makes him very dangerous. <laughs> Yeah. 
Uh oh. This isn't going to be pretty. Suplex! And determination of Ali got a bit challenged there. Freeze dished out severe punishment, and his opponent is feeling the effects. Bang! The ref's count ain't stopping. The clock is ticking here. Someone going up top. He may be in a bad way here. State. And he the Boston crowd. Look at the back position. Oh, he's got something to prove, but he may lose this thing. Way to power out the Boston crowd. Was close. You know, when Ali gets like this, he's just so pretty to watch. Ali all over the ring. So much heart, so much determination, and it's paying off right now for Ali. has got him set up for the broken arrow. And we're looking at a very animated Damian Priest here. Elbow drop right on point. His defenses have fallen, and soon he may too. Yeah, this match has not been kind to him. Guys, we know that if Ali's heart is beating, he has a chance to turn this thing around. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds.
Here is your winner, Damian Priest. This kind of win establishes him to the world. An important win for him in this one. Ali's flight plan just got altered tonight with that loss. He'll rebound, don't worry. The following is a fatal four-way match. Making his way to the ring from San Diego, California, weighing in at 175 pounds, Rey Mysterio. There really is no challenge that can be considered impossible when it comes to Rey Mysterio. This dude has made a career out of defying the odds. Ladies and gentlemen, here comes the phenomenal one. A man who exceeded all expectations in WWE and is now a first ballot Hall of Famer. And his opponents, first from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, the phenomenal AJ. AJ Styles has a trophy case filled with titles. A WWE Grand Slam champion. This man has done it all, and he has absolutely no fear. There is one thing we've learned all throughout the years, and that's do not bet against AJ Styles. Hey, he might not be the biggest dog, but AJ Styles has got the strongest bite. And there's no one who fights bigger bell to bell than AJ Styles. You're right, if AJ's breathing, AJ's fighting. Here comes the prize fighter. Kevin Owens is always ready for a fight. And from Marieville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens! Well, he calls himself the prize fighter, and he's earned that moniker as of late. You're absolutely right, Saxon. You have to remember main event battles with Stone Cold Steve Austin and Roman Reigns. A look of pure focus on the face of the prize fighter. Because KO always has his eyes on the prize. This man is six foot three, 275 pounds of pure power. Perhaps the strongest man in WWE. And from Colorado Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 273 pounds, the almighty Bobby Lashley. 
We've seen it so many times. When that bell rings, Bobby Lashley flips a switch. And on display, we yeah. witness his frightening intensity. I mean, frightening power as well, Byron. Everything about Bobby Lashley is just intimidating. The presence of Bobby Lashley is not a figment of your imagination. There's no filter on a social media app needed. Bobby Lashley is as real as it gets. Hey, he's a peak physical specimen. Proud U.S. Army veteran who's dominated sports entertainment for nearly two decades. Fatal four-way rules in effect here as the match gets underway. Every superstar for themselves with Rey Mysterio, AJ Styles, Kevin Owens, and Bobby Lashley. In this type of match, you have to watch your back at all times. There's never a moment where you won't be potentially in the crosshairs. The only way to guarantee safety is ensure you can turn things around into a one-on-one -on -one fight. And if that means having to dismantle an opponent to the point that they're out of the equation entirely, then so be it. critical to be adaptable. If it's anything goes, then use that to your advantage before your opponent does. This is an incredible level to be reminded real quick. What goes around, comes around. And you might be forced to revamp your strategy when you least expect it. Swing for the fences with a kendo stick. Send your opponent crashing through a table. Fight up the ramp. Whatever insanity you can come up with, it's fair game. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. 